Municipal elections swept across the province on October 15th, with West Kelowna Mayor Gord Milsom earning a second term with a landslide victory. It's an honour to be uh, re-elected for another four years to represent uh, you know, our city as a mayor. So I really appreciate the trust and the confidence that our residents have, uh, have given me. And I'm excited, but I must say I'm looking forward to uh, the next four years. Uh, we've got a bright future here in the city of West Kelowna. The city of West Kelowna will welcome back four of its six councillors, opening the door for change. Tasha De Silva, who finished third in councillor voting, is looking forward to bringing fresh ideas to the table. So I've spent the last 14 years working with small business, so retail stores and restaurants, and I know there's a lot of small business that have really been hurt by the pandemic uh, and our tourism industry. So I would love to really focus my attention on uh, both economic development as well as uh, initiatives for affordable housing. Milsom says he's excited to get started with his new council, both in finishing incomplete projects and starting new ones for the future. Number one project is a Rose Valley water treatment plant, which, which will provide safe, clean, reliable water to 18,000 of our residents. And that's going to be completed in the spring, so that's project number one. We've got to get that done. We're going to complete our city hall library, our first city hall. Uh, so there's lots to do to continue to uh, make a good positive change within our community. As Milsom prepares to take the seat for another four-year term, a recount may be in order for the council, as the final councillor's chair came down to just a single vote. I'm Braden Ursel in West Kelowna for Castanet.